and we're back. And um, to close this session, um, to finish off on session 10 here, um, I want us just to consider, and I hope you've already been talking about this, um, what it means uh, to abide in Jesus and, and, uh, and how we can do that. Abiding is important because it has all the benefits that we spoke of earlier in terms of helping us to understand truth and separate it out from lies and, uh, and all that, that kind of thing. But how do we get closer to Jesus? Well, there's lots of ways of doing that, but the one important thing that I think we need to understand and resolve in ourselves is this, that if we're going to get closer to Jesus, it's going to take time, that we're going to have to give time to it. So whatever it is we're going to do to, to deepen and enhance our relationship with him, whatever it is we're going to do, it's going to take time which means it's going to take a commitment. We all live such busy lives these days, and there are so many pressures on us from so many different directions that um, very often our spiritual life and our walk with Jesus can get undermined and, and, and sidetracked. And, uh, and we need to do things that uh, help us to avoid that. And we won't be able to do that if we don't spend time abiding in Jesus. And uh, so we need a commitment. We need a, a strategy. We need to... Um, plan out how we are going to find that time, when we're going to schedule that time in, and then we need to, to be absolutely ruthless in keeping it and not let things interrupt that time. Um, if you have a, a daily uh, quiet time or even a noisy time, noisy times to me seem to be better things, uh, but if you're having a daily time uh, with God that you've got set aside, uh, make sure nothing encroaches on that. and Make sure that um, not just that you read the scriptures, but that you that you pray and that you spend time listening and, and just sitting in his presence and hearing what God has to say to you. Uh, it's really important that we do that, but it takes time. So the big thing that I think I, I, I want you to go away with from this session is this, that if I am going to abide in Christ, then I'm going to have to take the time to do that. I'm going to have to make the time to do that and make sure that nothing else interferes with that time. I hope that challenges you and blesses you and I look forward to seeing you next session.